Welcome to Vlog 85, Vlog 85. So we had an Apple event in September on a Tuesday. It seems like they do it on Tuesdays quite often. Sometimes after an Apple event, you stop smoking and you start using hauls and you're trying to cut back on cigarettes because you need the extra money for the next latest and greatest Apple device. And when Apple launches their in-store products, you kind of get beat up and you lose uh, a camera lens on your glasses uh, and, 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 and th times get rough because you need the latest and greatest. The thing is, with the latest and greatest Apple product that Apple releases, life comes into effect as four things. Four things categorizing your life. Necessary and important, not necessary and not important, or necessary but not important, or important but not necessary. So there's those four categories of life. I might have said not not important but necessary. I might have goofed up on that. So but but the thing is I have the 2016 iPhone SE first gen. This is a golden gem. I is still my daily driver. Um, it's a very golden little gem. And it's from 2016. I bought, I didn't get this until like 2020 or 2021, used off eBay. It's it, it's a golden golden device. But um, do I use these every day? No, I don't. Um, I'm just using these as a metaphor. But um, I have currently um, done two purchases of iPhone 11 regular and two purchases of, of iPhone 11 Pro Max. Um, these 11s are really durable. This has a street fair market value of $120 if it's in excellent shape that this iPhone 11 regular. This is actually my second iPhone 11 regular. Um, I'm going to remove the camera lenses and remove the tempered glass protector. It is in good to excellent shape. The thing is, there are some companies that are offering around $800 trade-in value uh, for this. Um, am I going to do it? Am I doing it? Only time will tell. But just don't be going out selling your beloved ski cap that um, your Mima uh, made you just for the latest and greatest. You don't need the latest and greatest only if it's necessary and important and that factors in your life. But I can't tell you what to what you're doing, but there are some that um, do need the latest and greatest, whether it's for work or um, whatever factors there might be in your life. But it is really interesting how durable these iPhone 11s are. And I've never heard of a, a trade-in, like a, just walk into the store and trade in $800 for a $120 iPhone 11. These iPhone 11s are very durable. All four of these purchases of iPhone 11, the two iPhone 11 regular and the two iPhone 11 Pro Max, have never got warranty to replace. They're in excellent shape. Sure, the screen might have been replaced, the front screen or something, but they're very durable. Got a fine bottle of water and two Amazon packages. Got another box of Black Raven Nitrile, 100 count rubber gloves, extra large, lint roller, and a medium strength bristle Colgate 360 toothbrush. Titanium. So I got the iPhone 15 Pro Max Blue Titanium.
comes with a woven charging cable and stickers. Very minimalistic design. Got an Amazon package. Lithium ion battery. Let's crack this open. Okay, got a bracelet, which is a cuff, genuine leather. I actually don't think it's leather. I think it might be plastic. It might be plastic. And another Anchor product. This is the battery. It's a backup battery. Let's crack this. This is a PowerCore 5000, which is an Anchor 321 power bank. Comes with a USB-A to USB-C cable. And this is the small, compact, portable power bank. One. All right, another, um, haven't done a parking lot video in a while, um, at an asphalt location, Amazon package, another anchor thing, another anchor, uh, moving around, going to, ca uh, going to cafe right now, this is another anchor, it is anchor power port 3 20 watt power cube, there are two of them, this is an, ident this is an identical purchase to my other purchases, got two 20 watt charger bricks and this is USB-C it's a 20 watt output which is 5 volt 3 amp and the prongs actually fold good one more trailer nope uh, Paul grew up on a farm and he had mules so he had a scar across the back of his hand because he wrapped it So it was on a Tuesday, there's an Apple event. Current, um, I want to say around October 3rd is when I unboxed the Apple device. I had multiple purchases of, multiple purchases of uh, iPhone 6S. I've had a 7 Plus. And this is my latest device that I am operating. Thank you for watching up to this point. And currently enjoying some coffee. That's a wrap.